Well, I am an architectural lighting designer. I'm the design director and founder of Studio Remark, my own architectural lighting practice based in Dubai. Uh, I work a lot in Saudi. I'm a hospitality lighting specialist. Um, so it's where all the new builds are happening, the really exciting projects, the developments, um, you know, all towards vision, you know, 2030, and we are reared up and ready to come. How would Expo 2030 in Riyadh impact the lighting industry? Well, it just brings, naturally, it's bringing all of the projects to a faster realization than uh, if the projects uh, were, you know, if, they, if there wasn't a huge event taking place. Um, that brings all the lighting designers, all the interior designers, all the architects. That brings a great opportunity for all the manufacturers. Um, so it's a great economic growth for everybody in the industry. Actually, we had multiple meetings, and one of them was uh, Zaha Hadid the team visiting us on our stand as well, and which was really great. Uh, 70 years of heritage and lighting, and our core uh, values are innovation, technology, and tradition. We recently just launched uh, one of our latest products, which was designed by a very famous architect in, uh, in Italy. His name is Alessandro Scandura. And it was made a collaboration between Panzeri and Alessandro, and the item is uh, launched now. Uh, it's available in a floor lamp, which is for indoor and outdoor use. And you have it as well as a wall lamp and as a suspension. It, it is a meeting ground for uh, uh, companies from for industries to meet with hotel developers, operators, and to work on the future projects and the vision of 2030.
It's extremely important uh, because it gives us the opportunity to meet our aim of uh, developers, residential project, meeting with architects, with uh, lighting designers. Actually, we had multiple meetings and one of them was Zaha Hadid, the team visiting us on our stand as well, and which was really great. Yeah.